Yo, so uh, it's 3.23 a.m. I just wanted to say something real quick. I'm streaming right now. Uh, the goal is not to cancel this guy, just to clarify before we go any further in the video. Just wanted to point out how he said some dumb and I want to make sure that he acknowledges he said some dumb He knows what he did. I want to make sure that he takes accountability for it, he apologizes for it, move on, whatever. I just want, just want him to acknowledge that it happened because like what he did is not okay. And you'll see that later on. Anyways, thank you for listening. Uh, be sure to watch the whole video. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you at the end. <laughs> oh, look, it's my mouse. How about that? No, we don't, we don't got time. We don't got time for that. Come on, man. Come on, Nix. So the other day, I wanted to watch The Real Lost and Unbound Exposure. And if you don't know what this is, it's a video, as you can see, by Christopher London, LSK, however you know him. Uh, and it's basically literally it was a 40 minute exposed video or 30 minute. I don't remember how long it was on Lost and Unbound. Uh, how he paid his editors like a dollar fifty an hour. Like you know the LNU story. If you don't do some research, but I go to watch that video and I see that it's private. And just to confirm, because I realize it's a random private page, won't do anything. Yep, private. So yeah, I see this and I see that there's this guy making two wide videos. Like he's been my recommended. I'm not gonna say his name for obvious reasons, aside from the title and maybe the description, probably the tags. I'm not going to be saying this name. What I will say is that he has been making a bunch of two hype videos. Like for the last three weeks, it's been nothing but two hype. So I'm like, hey, maybe I can DM this guy, let him know if that this is going on, because this seems like a kind of fishy thing for LSK to do. <laughs> like this is, it's not like this video, like he deleted this the same time we deleted his Mopey video. He got like a million views on this or something like that. So like this was no like small potatoes or anything. So I'm just like, all right, let me go DM this guy. And then I see that I'm blocked. Immediately I'm confused. Like <laughs> I was like, yo, what did I do? I've never seen this guy in my life. What, 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 you, what you talking about, bro? So then I go and I type in my name. Like, uh, here I'll show you how, how Twitter works in case you guys want to use it for your own benefit. Like, I put my I put my at, at Lose again, and I put his at, and I see I called him a loser back in August. I called him a loser. And I remember I remember calling him a loser, too. But I'm just like, that that's weird, dude. I've never, like, what could make me call this guy a loser? And then I remember, oh, wait, there's me calling him a loser again. <laughs> So yeah, I see I call this guy a loser, and uh, then I realized something that happened that day. Like, I just realized, yo, look at the timestamp, 6.58, immediately I go to this guy's at, and I, I call him a loser. Look at the timestamp. But, my homie Legs, I'm not gonna say like, oh, Legs and I are really close friends, but I've known Legs for about five years. Like, on and off. Bro, y'all remember the like sus account that was telling me to kill myself and stuff? I'm not going to say the other word. I don't know why I said kill myself, but I won't say that. I, I don't know. I'm weird. And I'm like, no, I, I don't remember, but elaborate. And then he said, it was, I'm not, again, I can't say his name. Uh, it was water bottle. Yep. It was water bottle the whole time. This weirdo made a whole account just to tell me to kill myself and that I suck. Lamo! Imagine being that much of a loser, I swear to God. <laughs> And then I'm just like, uh, all right, bet. Like before he posted this, and this is more proof, by the way, before he posted this, I went up and, uh, that's when I called him a loser. And then, uh, that led to the block. As you can tell by his facial reaction, uh, big sad, big sad by, by my end. Now I can't look at lyric tweet. But, mm, I said his name. I said his name. These are likes. We're going to look at some of these tweets, right? Like here is likes us. You're such a weirdo, bro. Honestly, kill yourself. You're such a F word. You're not funny, bro. You're so cringe. Sample 5,000 on why legs likes men. Yep, look at that name too. Here he is, he's liking lyric tweets. And I could see like, oh, maybe it's just a coincidence. But like, like, come on now. So I see this and I'm like, oh, okay. Uh, that's that's weird, but it doesn't really confirm it. So like at this point now I'm just thinking, oh great, I bandwagoned. But then, I was looking through it some more, a lot more. This was December 29th, 2020. I posted this on one of his videos. Never forget when he told Legs HD to kill himself. Waiting to see how long it takes for this to get deleted. And then, <laughs> and then this video right here popped up. Oh, take a look at this. I got the two wife treatment. Dude's deleted my comment. Oh my God. 
I didn't actually think he would. What a loser. So yeah, as as that video happened, I kept I got in contact with Like Still and he saw I sent him that video and he was like, yo, he's deleting comments? And I was like, I mean, I don't know if he's deleting comments, he deleted mine. And then I pointed out another, like, piece of uh, evidence that I found. Legs made a video back in September of 2020 when the game started to come out. Uh, like, just locker codes. It's, it's a very common thing that 2K YouTubers do. I did it for a long time. You already know, I'm the emperor of locker codes. So, like, he, he made his locker code video. This is just in case the guy ever denied knowing Legs. You go through the locker, you go through, there are six comments, not a lot of comments. There are six comments. One of them is from this dude. <laughs> and in case you think, oh, maybe this is a fake account. First of all, who's making fake accounts of this dude? That's kind of weird. Look at that. Same subs, same videos, all too hype, uh, dick riding. So yeah, you already know now it's him. And now like I'm getting screenshots too from this guy, from legs, from like DM conversations that he had with so-and-so. He said, you're a weirdo. I think that mean he called this dude a weirdo. He made a whole account to call him sus, get a life. And then Mans was like, LMFAO! <laughs> like, he thought this, like, he actually thought this was funny. <laughs> like, he made a whole account to insult this guy. Like, telling him to kill himself, calling him hard F. And then he admits to it, too. Here's the admission right here. Being like, yo, it was funny. I'm not one to get triggered. At least I don't think I'm one to get triggered. But this doesn't look funny to me. Like... I like to think I have a pretty solid sense of humor. Like, if you're in my streams or you watch my videos even, like, you would think, like, I, I don't know, man. Like, this just doesn't, this doesn't seem like the move. And then something he just sent me. Man's made anti-Semitic comments towards legs. Yo. <laughs> like, I'm not going to repeat that. Like, the other ones I repeated, sure, but, like... This guy is, this guy's mental. This guy's actually mental. I don't even know, man. You want to see something wild? Look at that man's bio. Make, make kill yourself funny again. This man is stuck in 2016. He's trying his best to cling on to some commentary genre. And in the interest of not getting canceled, hold up. Here's my YouTube channel from back in the day. I made a bunch of weird videos. Even like they're my most popular videos. I made weird videos for real. Some call it harassment. I'd probably call it harassment looking back. I was 14, 15 trying to get views. And here's where, here's the difference. Like, I admit to, like, when I own up to my issue. Here's my channel. Go check it out. I don't upload it on it, but yeah. A lot of this was for attention. If, first of all, if you're not doing YouTube for attention, you're kind of weird. But, like, you got to do it for, like, positive attention. Like, if you, like, for me, like, I, that's why I'm not really focusing on making drama videos on this channel. The closest I made was that Too High video a few weeks ago. And this is it. And I'm not making another video on this. This is going to be it. Whatever's added onto it, it's added onto it. I was actually friends with this guy. But because, like, I was petty and someone and someone toxic was feeding me into it, I kind of ruined the friendship a little bit. That's how toxic I was. And I'm willing to admit that. This guy is weird, though. Like, this guy right here, he's weird. And he's getting a platform to do this. He's basically getting rewarded for telling people to kill themselves. Think about that. Think how crazy that is. It's crazy to say. Imagine how crazy it is to hear. Especially when he's making videos like this. Talking about two hype. Like trying to call them out. Calling out two hypes. Ethics. Calling out their morals. All he does is call out other YouTubers. But yet he's out here making comments towards people. On burners. On burners. Telling them to kill themselves. Calling them hard F. Calling them this, that, and the other thing. Again, I'm done with this dude now. This video is staying on the channel. I don't care what happens. I don't know if this video is going to even do anything. It's staying on the channel, though, for whoever wants to see it. I'm out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like, subscribe. But, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for me, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. Peace, peace. What a weirdo, dude.